Waldorf salad for two. Don't you love a Waldorf salad? That is an, a salad originated at the Waldorf Hotel in New York City, later to become the Waldorf Astoria. Cole Porter's thing about this salad is in his song, You're the Top. And I've always loved a good Waldorf, but you have to veganize everything you love, people, and it can be done. So it's nice to have a little apple core slicer handy tool because you already get them into wedges and then we can chop them up a little bit here. I pre-chopped my celery and then the other things we're going to put in here are some walnuts and some, uh, I have some organic dark big juicy plump raisins, a little bit of, um, a little bit of uh, a non-dairy yogurt to kind of, I don't, uh, I'm not usually a huge fan of any kind of yogurt, but this salad's going to be good. And we're going to do a little bit of lemon juice. Sprinkle that around. It'll keep the apples in. And then just a little bit of the mayonnaise, the veganaise, the veganaise, the veganaise. I will learn how to say that one of these days. I don't know when, but it's important to me. When someone writes to me and say, learn how to say the day mayo product, will ya? Probably the company's going to call me and say hello. Alright, I might have uh, chopped these in a more beautiful way if I weren't trying to show you that you can make the salad quickly. But here I am making it kind of big, big places. I used a Honeycrisp and a Granny Smith. And did I get all my lemon juice in there? There's my celery. And you know what? My bowl's a little small. I like it when I, when I mix things up in a bigger bowl and then I come back and I would put it in a bowl like this, but I, I prefer to mix, mix big and then transfer to the size that works. And you've got some room to play with. You know what I mean? So just, just get a little bit of that. We're going to play with this for a minute and get it all together. It's going to look and taste delicious. Love Waldorf salad. Just how can you not love the combination of apples and walnuts and nice juicy raisins? You can use grapes if you like to, and you can also put it on a, a bed of lettuce for a light supper or a, a light lunch. It's delicious. I'm Jill of Cab. Find me on social media. Keep taking good care of yourself shopping at your local health food stores. Have a great one.